Great. Here we go. <laughs> no, it's fierce, though. Like. <laughs> Here we are live, wow. at, live at the Paddo. Shout out to the Paddo first. Yeah. Hello, Paddo. Hello, Paddo. Hello, Paddo. Paddo. The heart and soul of Mount Hawthorne in WA. The heart and soul, Paddo. The heart and soul of Mount Hawthorne. We just got here. We literally just yep. got here. Yep. We have not been on stage for the last two hours. <laughs> I've just rolled in. I'm We've on my first just beer. Got here. Round 17 is just starting in the Shout room. out to Fleet Network before we forget it. Yeah, Powering course. the podcast. Powering Fleet Network. Don't over- sa- over- take Nova yourself Ted yourself a lease if you haven't already. Does anyone here have a car? Yeah. Who Hands has a car? a car? Who has a car and or a full-time job? Me. Not for long. Yep. Uh, but I do, <laughs> and I'll be novoteting myself at least. Absolutely. Here we are. The, the back chat Brownlow special. I thought we'd call it the back low. The back Is low. that what you thought? Wow. Maybe. I don't know. Does Does everyone like the back no, low? I hate it. No, nah, hate it. No, okay. we love it. We, no, love we it. do love it. Where's the boy? He'll be somewhere. Keep going, Dan. The inaugural back chat Brownlow event. We're going to be doing this every year. Every, because it's that bloody well good. Been. Everyone came out. So thank you for coming Actually, out. Actually, a massive turnout. There is some I can't count, Mark. I can't count. Count past 10,000, but I'm looking at him. Nick Dacos, what a star. Ah, there is some amazing outfits. Absolutely. We're in some velvet suits, thanks to Suit Vault, of suit course. Vault. Yep. And Will Brayshaw. And Will Brayshaw. Shout and out. Hammer's wearing his... Sandover Sand medal, over everybody. Thank you very much. I did win that. Shut. Sandover Ooh. medalist in the house, everybody. Yeah. Probably the more important award. Obviously, the Brownlow's pretty good, but like, fuck. Who wouldn't want to it's win a that? midfielder's award. The Sandover. Yeah, Sandover. So is the Sandover, let's be honest. <laughs> nah, I was forward for a bit this year. That's anyway, true. it's round 17. You keep it's going. I'll yell out if we need to do anything. We've started early. I feel like we're going to have to pad, but no, that's, that's, that's what we do here. Backchatpodcast.com.au. Also, backchatstudios.com.au well, is where you can find merch, yep. all the shows that we make yep. under a Backchat. Uh, oh, shit, yeah, merch. Oh, shit, shit yeah, merch. merch. Get yourself has that. anyone else? Has anyone here bought the Oh, shit, yeah, merch? Jack Just Buckley. Yet? There we go. We've got hands. Jack, Jack Buckley. Buckley. Hang on a minute. Jack Buckley. Jack Buckley. Oh! Anyway, continue. We have Helio. a deal. We for shout the bar if Jack Buckley, in, which Andrew is everybody. Rachel. Yeah, that's right. If Jack Buckley gets a vote in the Brownlow, we shout the bar. We shout the bar. And at also, least 300 so people Fremantle here. just had their round. And if anyone else is watching, if Andrew Brayshaw gets three votes, it's currently round 17. He is going to give us a live finger wiggle from the Brownlow Brown medal. The first votes that Dusty Martin ever So got. just just to bring you up to speed, if you have continue. no clue what's happening with the Brownlow right now, Lockie Neal, 23 votes. Nick Dacos, 22 votes. Christian Petraga, 21 votes. Uh, Nick Dacos can not Oh, Petraga, 22. Wow. Ooh. Nick Dacos is going to have to really no, sizzle. No. He, can't, he can't win he it. Can't. I, don't, I just don't he think he win can. It. He has to go 3-3-3. Three, three, three. He has to go the Hamish Brayshaw special. Yeah, or rounds 11, 13, 14. West Coast gets a vote here. I'll spew up. Lockie Neal. Harris Andrews is a back. Well, Lockie, Lockie Neal has just become Jack the current leader of the Brownlow medal at round 17. It's all happening here at the Paddo. But of course, we've got to give our back chat listeners, right. regular podcast listeners, we've got to give them the goods for what happens week to week. Uh, let's that Nick Dacos, three votes! There's a lead change! Sorry. There's a lead change. I know we're in the middle of a podcast, but... We are playing a bit of a... Br- uh, we're playing a, a drinking bingo. game. So, oh, that's a Falcon. So oh, while this ad's going, I'll... Um, I got a text message earlier in the day. Sorry for everyone live, but this is for the listeners. Um... Got a text message from you earlier in the day saying, can I have some drinking games? And I said, yep, no worries, mate. Bang. I'm in the middle of a three-week band to have these. And um, so we're there spot. was a few going, and one of which was, uh, well, you added the Dacos brothers. One of There were about okay. some about Andrew. Jack if Buckley. Jack Buckley gets a vote, we all we shout the bar. So there's a lot happening. So if you hear me yelling at any point sporadically, uh, it's not planned. It's just something has happened that invokes a drink from the crowd. So. Yep. If you're just listening to this randomly and you're in... I don't know, Zimbabwe, because you just like the Bat Chat podcast. Do you apologise? Oh, no. no apologies necessary. It's just a bit different. Right. It's just a little bit different. Uh, we are just keeping track. Christian Petrarca, we've established, is a very nice man. But yeah. we are sort of <laughs> Lovely a, fella. A lovely fella. He, Tex Walker, not so much. No, Tex Walker. Uh, well, no, we're not saying that on the podcast. Continue. <laughs> uh, here we go. We've got five, six rounds to go before. You just keep Brownlee talking. And I'll, don't worry about that. You just course. focus you just, on the You just sheet. fire some stuff off. Let's just go straight off for some footy chat because sure. this is what's happened. There's been two games on the weekend. The yep. winners go into the grand final. The prelim games. Devastating. GWS v 
v Collingwood. Let's start with those. Devastating. Three Devastation. votes, three no votes in a loss. Three votes in a loss. No, in a loss. no one in the country wanted Collingwood to win. Not especially a on this podcast. Except Collingwood fans. Except for Collingwood fans. So, so they that. lost by just not a lot. One Jack point. Buckley. Jack Buckley. Yes. Was fucking amazing. He actually was. In so that game. I know, we, was, I know we get him. I know we, we get him. We prop, prop him up. Jack Buckley. Here we go. Jack Alex Buckley. Buckley. Jack Buckley. Oh. oh. Anyway, Jack Buckley in that game was phenomenal. Fucking if, strong if they in the air. Round below votes for knees. finals, he would have got at least two, right? Yeah. He was awesome that da- day. Bond. Marcus Bond Pelly has just got two votes. Gordon's got three votes. Nah, it's it was disappointing to see GWS. I think the entire lower. country was looking at GWS as their team. Well, they, everyone forward. knew that there was a big, big sound, and that was what hurt us a lot. Noah Anderson is coming third in the Brownlow. Who's got Noah out here? No, no, no one's one. got Noah. He wasn't in top. He if wasn't Noah in top wins, ten. we shout the bar. How about that? Well, this is a big one because if Christian Petrarca gets three here, this will be big. See Petrarca. Wow, we we have a new equal leader, but Christian six Petrarca. Six rounds left. And, and Dacos is just about done. I can just imagine listening to this is not fun whatsoever. No, but that doesn't matter. It's Sorry, Nick Dacos needs three different. here to be any chance. Nick Dacos, Nick Dacos, Nick Dacos. Nick and Nick Josh. Dacos. Nick and Josh. 28. Lead change. 28 wins it in some years, though. Nick's only got two more rounds to go for everybody. He's got rounds 19. You're going to need and then he gets to win this, this year. He needs three next vote. He needs three in the next round to be any chance at all. So, so Scoey, you went pretty hard against Collingwood all le- like leading could, up. I could not have been more flat when GWS lost that yeah. prelim final. You did the per- you, you, you put a, uh, a post Can on the video. Can you just imagine the carry on if, Sorry, GWS, if GWS were in the grand final? Can you just imagine how much we would have been carrying on on this podcast? Oh, we, we, we hitched the trailer early. We got behind Jack Buckley, defensive player. We would have bought year. a corporate box. I wouldn't have needed to because I would have been in there already. <laughs> That's true. But Collingwood managed to hang on. Six minutes left in the in the prelim final. One point up. They hold on. I hate to say it, but Collingwood actually deserved to be there. Collingwood do deserve to be there, and it hurts me to say it. But um, but did you do a, like? I feel like they sort of lost it. They had a lot of opportunities to score goals. Yes, they did lots. And they just cost themselves. It, the shame was that Jack Buckley was a defender because he couldn't kick the goals for them. He was doing everything he could, and he wasn't in the forward line. Collingwood probably deserved to be there, which hurts me to say, but they're the favourites going into the Jack league. Buckley went off the field injured for a while. That's and, what that's And what literally, him. Collingwood had a run on when he was off the field. Brent Daniels was off HIA. What, what was happening with Sam Taylor? He was shit. Wow. One of the best defenders in the league. He, he did not have a good game, Sam. I'm, I'm sorry to say. Yeah. Cooper Hamilton, maybe the best performed non-playing prelim player of all time. Yeah. Cooper Hamilton, one of the great social media activists of all time. Ever. Anyone see Cooper's action on, on social media, GWS? Yeah, Good it's very, you. very good. Elite. Good you, that is. Okay, from GWS, Jordan DeGoey, Collingwood. Wow, he Just was fucking awesome. Killing. And he was on the bench for like the last eight minutes of the quarter. I did see a lot of chatter I around think, that. I think is he still in actually, your back pocket? Actually, I have him in my back pocket, Jordan. Yes. 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 I found him, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> there he is. One last thing on that game, the commentary, the commentary was disgraceful. God, God awful. They loved. They wanted Collingwood to be there so bad that they were cheering. I mean, when GWS and this happened the other game, when GWS did something good, they were flat. They didn't give him much. Well, mate, I did say this on a shelter footy cast that blew up, but the AFL desperate to Collingwood to make the grand final and win it, and I stand by it. They're in there now, and AFL are fucking... It's a wet dream for them. Thank God that Carlton <laughs> didn't win it, otherwise they would have fucking... I hope it. there's an article written that says it is a wet dream for the AFL for Collingwood if to make the grand Collingwood final. If Collingwood and Carlton had made the grand final, Gill would have just come. It's just as simple <laughs> as that. that. Put that in a fucking article. Gill would have come. It actually... It would have been a big deal. Amy Brayshaw of Backchat Studios but, okay, says so, Gil would have come. That's the thing is though, yeah. if we if we put the um, the sexual arousal, <laughs> we put the sexual arousal to the side. Carlton Collingwood <laughs> would have been a, a bit of a blowout. It I'd would say have, yeah. Colling- oh, blowout! Is that right? Collingwood would have, would have just. <laughs> is that right? Blowout. <laughs> Sorry. So now we have. Yep. Actually, now we got. Let's let's, let's go, go to the Brisbane. Let's game. go to Brisbane Carlton. Uh, Carlton started 
sizzling. Yeah, and Gil it had looked, a Bacchus. It looked over. It Gil looked was over. far past Bacchus Marsh at that point. He was closer to Ballarat. <laughs> he was ready to go. And then all of a sudden, it just went down and down and down. And by the end of it, he was you, pissing standing up. It reminded me, and <laughs> <laughs> it actually reminded me of 2018. Literally, when I was watching it, I was like, they need to, they need to put the, the pedal on now. Or they're Carl- leaving the Carl- door. Carlton were, li- Carl- were never winning. Never. But they did what they had to early, yeah. right? To, to, oh, yeah. They, they could not have on. started better. Mate, they, it was off. Buster Douglas out there with a the puncher's chance. Buster chair. Douglas, you reckon? Beat Mike Tyson. <laughs> he went out there and threw his best shot. <laughs> Although Buster Douglas, Douglas actually won. But Mike Tyson <laughs> came back and went bang. Anyway, so it's, it, it was a puncher's chance, went bang. The Gabba. The, the, the Gabba. Gabba undefeated the for the is whole that, year. Is that the first time a team has gone undefeated at home the entire year? No. Well, you'd have to check the history books for like don't through ask me. finals. Don't, don't ask me. What you would have to do is through like North, finals. North Melbourne games. and Hawthorne. Yeah. Home and away. Well, West Coast did in 2018. North yeah, Melbourne, did they win, did they North win Melbourne and home? Hawthorne play at Aurora. No, they lost like game one against like Sydney because you got. You got 10 goals kicked to you against Buddy. Is that right, Dan? Is that right? <laughs> 2018 I re- I round one. I, re- <laughs> I reckon Melbourne went undefeated at TIO Stadium for one year. Did they? They played there once and they won it. Right, here we go. Round 19. Keep uh, talking, Dan. We don't need to talk about it. We don't need to talk about it. Round one. So Carlton, Brisbane. Carlton, Carlton Brisbane. Never, never deserved to be in it. And Brisbane will I'm, always I'm, win. I'm glad it's Brisbane Collingwood. So am I. The I would have been a lot happier with fucking GWS. Yes, Brisbane. of course. But... Collingwood, Brisbane, the best two teams of the, in the league. They deserve to be in and the grand GWS. final. Brisbane are going to have a, a huge like offense. They're going to. It's going to be. A sh- it's going to be a bit of a shootout, though. That's a good yes. thing. It'll be a good old-fashioned With, Texas shootout. No question about it. Absolutely. I hope, like nothing else, that Brisbane win. Yes. Same. I just. I can't stand. I think we're all on. Is every, is everyone here? So we're all at the Pado. Who's going for Collingwood in the grand final? Who's going for Brisbane? Yes! <laughs> and who wishes, who wishes GWS were in it? Yeah! Jack Buckley! Jack Buckley for the norm. <laughs> All right, let's talk about the grand final then. We might as well. Here we go. Round 19. Round 19. You keep talking, Dan. I'll, uh, I'll say if anything Nick happens. Nick Dacos has three votes in front of you. He's not winning, though. Nick Dacos needs three votes in this round to be any chance of winning it. Are we shouting the bar if Brayshaw does this? No. We're just no, no. We just everyone it. skull. Everyone, it's a fullback. Here no, we go. No, no, not this round. Not this round. Not this round. Errol, Errol Golden. Caleb. Caleb Sarong. Luke. 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 Parker. Luke. Uh-oh. A, maybe a good question to you both. Yes. Yep. Out of Collingwood and Brisbane. Oh, Ed Kerno's got his bow tie off. He's loose. Yeah. He's pissed. Out of Collingwood and Brisbane, which Toby. player? Which Jack Buckley. Oh, Sam, Sam Taylor. 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 Sam Could Taylor. Have, Jack have a drink. Buckley, yeah. That's close. Which player are you most happy for? Because obviously there's going to be a player from Collingwood or Brisbane that are going to win a, a premiership medal. Which one? Am I which for? player are you most happy for? I would have said Nathan Murphy, right? Harris Andrews, another backman. Harris Andrews. I would have said Nathan Murphy. Okay. But, but Nathan Murphy. I've heard was going the mental health card at Jesse Hogan. Was I've he? Heard that. I've heard that. I back Jesse Hogan in now. Nathan Nathan Murphy can. You know as, as as a West Coast fan, I used to dislike Jesse Hogan. So Sorry. He played for free. Bye. 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 Oh. Oh. So he was going the mental health card at Jesse Hogan. Yeah, that's correct. That's a little bit like um, Taylor. What? Sorry. Um, <laughs> okay, so out of G- uh, sorry, out of Brisbane and Collingwood. Which player are you most happy for to win a premiership? I hope John Noble gets a game and he, he wins. Well, that because would mean Mick, Collingwood. Mick stays win. out. Yes. So he does Noble come in. plays full game, Noble sub. You're happy for Collingwood to win? Uh, okay. Yeah, okay. Uh, I think no, pick, pick one player from each Harris team. Harris Andrews, bro. So Noble, Harris Andrews. Harris Andrews. I want Josh Dunkley to win. Because oh, I like Lockie Neal. He's a friend of the family. Do I you? also like yeah, Lockie I've, Neal. I've met, he, Andrew lived with him for a bit. Like He's actually quite a nice guy. I would be happy for him to win a premiership. So, Lockie Neal? Yeah, Lockie he's, Neal. Mate, he's done... I'll take that. He's, he's and played Hugh his... McCluggage is actually a fucking star. Oh, uh, North Melbourne are good at football. Yay, oh. West Coast won. West Coast, West Coast won. Simo goes... Oh, gosh. Simo keeps his job. 
Do you think Simu Simu's just unhappy? Toby Green, three votes. Thanks for three coming. Three votes. Tobias. Simu's Tobias unhappy Bilke. because he, he keeps a job. Because part of Simo would have been like, if I don't have my job, I get paid millions and I don't have to work. That's a good point. Now, all of a sudden, West Coast won and he's like, oh, well, now we, I'm probably going to get three sure, points. Sure, sure, We're live now. I can't say okay. anything. We have to... Bailey, Bailey Williams. Jay Williams. <laughs> big, 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 big. Dom Sheep. All right, let's have a drink. Dom Sheep, Bailey that. Williams, Oof. how are you? Is Dom Sheep... Oh, Tim Brad Kelly... Crap. Tim Kelly's gone quiet. Yeah, he's gone quiet. He'll finish with the he'll finish like a house on fire. Andrew Brayshaw! Oh, oh! Alex Duggan Pierce, everybody. What? The captain. Bullshit! Right, Andrew, 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 Andrew will have three in round 24. Oh. Boo! Taylor Walker got three votes. Taylor Walker, boo. Here we go. Nick Dacos needs three votes. He's not going to get it. Sucked in. Everybody, Nick Dacos does not win the round line from he here. He cannot right win. He it's is impossible. now out. It's impossible. Well, oh, it's a oh, yes! Now we're talking Hamish is serving Toby, drinks naked. Toby yeah. Green has just gotten three votes. Where the fuck's he at? It puts him up. Okay, Christian Petrarca. Okay. Angus Brayshaw. Okay. Angus Brayshaw! Max Gorn. Angus um, has not got a lot of votes. Nah, Angus has been quiet. So has Andrew, to be fair. Joel Amati's on four <laughs> votes. He had a three-vote game earlier in the year. Amati so, party. For everybody listening. Errol. Errol is sizzling. Rounds 21, 22, 23, and 24. After this round, there'll be four to go. Nick Dacos is leading by two. That's... Mate. Hang on a minute. Ooh. Took, 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 took. Took Miller. And, and, yeah, so Dacos leads by two round, two vote. Oh, bang! Bontempelli courage. Oof. And he kicked it too. This what must be on. such a great podcast. Good Guernseys. Good Guernseys. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there's Nick Dacos. He gets injured in this round. See bye you bye. later. Where's Josh? There's Tom. The Sears. from Sicily. We probably should have started after the Brownlow. <laughs> really? Shouldn't we? Well, that's okay. I'm here we're to watch the Brownlow. Yeah. So am I. It's a Brownlow special. Look, we're here to watch the Brownlow. If you're listening to this, go, I already know what I'm gonna, what's yeah, happened. You should have come down to the paddle. If you're having a bad yeah. time, you should have what come down What we will do for Oh, people. my golly God. Oh, <laughs> it's Jack Seville. See, I'm just going to be Cozzy. What I'm going to do for people who are listening is, that maybe try and get is when the Brownlow gets announced and he's finished, I'm going to say, oh, actually, because they'll be halfway through it. There's no point. I should have said at the start what time. Say it to, now. I'll say it when we get there. <laughs> I'll say it's this point. You crop in, and then we're going to go back to the start. Damo's going to edit it in saying, skip to this point if you've already watched the Brownlow, because then we'll start. <laughs> I love a uh, guilt. I Gil would love to know what the other five people Damn, are doing do on this. Here we go! In front of the Brownlow. Essendon. V. West, West Coast. Coast. West Coast. West Coast. Kelly, Tim, Kelly, Tim Kelly. Kelly. Tim Kelly. Yes! Tim Kelly's got three votes. That's three, three votes. votes in a loss. In a loss. Nick Dacos. No. No. James's? Will, Will Day. Day. All right. Nick Dacos is now on 28 votes and he is done for the rest of the count. Does he, does he play enough to get a vote? No, he, he's Nick done now. Newman. He just had a he just had his last game and he didn't get a vote. Great. He's not winning. Darcy. Can confirm he's not winning. Jordan Dawson, what a gun. I love Jordan Dawson. Best kick ever. All right, Angus Brayshaw. So, so Bra Angus Brayshaw. Come on. Petrarca. Christian Petrarca. Everybody listening at three home, votes, Angus, Angus. Brayshaw just got three votes and ruined Patrick and Andrew. Andrew. Oh. oh. Boo. Boo. Andrew's had no votes. Andrew will get three in round 24, I guarantee wow, Anyway, man. Dan. Hey, hey just, we... just an update on the fashion show. Yeah. Fashion show. We have been... The, the Woo, Jack's Butters. 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 Butters, everybody. Uh, if you feel like you're best dressed and Nick hasn't tapped you on the shoulder already and said, hey, looking pretty good. We're going to do best dress soon. Yes. There's, there's two one hundred. Errol, Errol, Errol may be a big, big, big problem in the Brownlow tonight. He finishes. <laughs> yeah, correct. Strong. I know. There's two one hundred dollar vouchers. Liver, it's all right. Sorry, we are doing. A, yeah, you got a hundred dollar vouchers. Hundred dollar vouchers for best dress. Marcus Bontem Pelly. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. Wow. <laughs> Let's go. She's flat as. To be there. She's like, why am I here? Oh, oh where's Josh? Where's Josh? So Nick's talking for everyone I listening. Bet, I home. bet they go to Josh with the camera. Nick is talking. I'm actually here. surprised Josh doesn't have a microphone. 
I'll tell you what. So I'm looking at him, and I know that he's like, oh, he's, I can't hear what he's saying, but I bet you he's saying this. You know, it's whoever wins it, wins it. We've got a grand final to focus on, blah, blah, blah. He will be fucking devastated Look that he's not like eight see. votes in you front. Can Stupid fuck. Such a good player. He's 20 years old and he's the best player in the club. Where's his sideburns? That's all I'll be asking. I don't, okay, so, so Maynard loves the shave side as well. Yep. Uh, are we about the, the shaved V triangle thing in, in no. guys' No, we're not about it. Seems weird. Seems odd. I have no hair, though, so I don't <laughs> yeah. really get to comment on that. I go the short back and sides, but that's like a skin fade. Is that what you do, is it? What do you I ask for at the hairdressers? I just say what go do you sh- ask? I ask for a one to a two, so just like go short. You, you know the numbers. I just say go short on the sides and then chop a bit off the top. Short on chop the sides, a chop a bit top. off the top. Yeah, I'm not a fucking hero. <laughs> just cut my hair. Seriously, <laughs> they know what they're doing. Are you going to Salon Express? No. Main Street Barbers. Can That's we get Scarborough Nick off Barber. the stage? It's the last time we'll hear from him. Nick's not going to win the brown low. Anyway, what's next in the run sheet, Dan, while, while fucking Nick's chatting away? Do you know what we could actually do? Damo, could we launch Swimply? Here we go. <laughs> Who's winning Swimply? You're Swimply the best! Oh, oh, give it to me again. I'm sorry. I didn't hear pe- it. People in the back. The thousands listening at home. You're Swimply the best! <laughs> <laughs> This is our second last Swimply of the Best for the season. What about Dan's like form? Last. Meets the GM, CEO, owner of Swimply. He asks him face to face, why is your house not on Swimply? Dan just says, I don't want to. <laughs> wow. No, I didn't say I don't want to. It's he just... said, why is dad's pool not on Swimply? <laughs> yeah. Look, I love my dad too much. He, he said, hey, mate, do you love your dad? Probably. And by your dad, I mean your, your father-in-law. Yeah, I love... Dino and Steve. My dad, my, you mean my daddy, two dads. daddy. I actually have four dads. Uh, Dino, Steve, Elijah. Who's Elijah? <laughs> Who the fuck's Elijah? Hewitt. Of course, dad. <laughs> and, and Ruben. And, the, and Ruben. <laughs> my forefathers. Uh, wow. But <laughs> Mount Rushmore. <laughs> Mount, Rushmore. <laughs> Mount Rushmore of, of dads. fathers. <laughs> <laughs> Ruben Jinby on the Mount Rushmore of dads. Best guy. I don't, I don't know what to think about Harley Reid. Just, just sidebar, right? Ruben and Elijah have a special place in my heart. Does Harley, if West Coast pick him, flow straight into that? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to ask you. Ruben and, uh, and Elijah have a special place in my heart. Does Harley flow straight into that, Dan? I don't know if he does. It doesn't sound like it does. I feel like... Uh, I don't know if... Sorry. I'll put it to you this way, Dan. Okay, okay. There's four people on Mount Rushmore. Okay. Is there not? <laughs> yes. Abraham Lincoln's on there, I'm pretty yeah. sure. Yeah. George Washington's on there. Yeah. I couldn't tell the other two. <laughs> no, no one cares about those. Not so, with any certainty. So Does anybody Harley know the four, f- the four founding fathers if, of Mount if Rushmore? If anyone knows the rest no. of Mount Rushmore, congrats. Abraham Lincoln? But I'd said that. Abraham and George. George Washington? Yeah. I wasn't listening. So you've got Elijah and Reuben. Yes. If Harley Reid is all he's cracked up to be and West Coast decide not to split the pick and draft him, yep. and he is just as good as everyone thinks he is, yep. what he happens? goes straight into second place behind yep. the boy. Yes. No one's going to overtake the boy. Why is the right? boy on Mount Rushmore? Because Why is we he love Judd the boy. Cousins. No, no, no. This is, is Judd Cousins. This Cox, is the Eagles of the, the future. Boy. This is now. This is the Mount Rushmore of the future. Now. <laughs> the boy. Maybe. The boy. The Who? boy's number one. So the boy. The boy. The boy. The, the boy is here. Yep. Do we have the boy over there? Do we have? Do we have the boy? Turn it up. Right the back of his hand. Them are the boys. He don't give a damn. He words. can run on the wing. Yes, he can. Chase you down. Can chase you down. Nothing can take. Nothing, nothing can take him down. down. He's the boy, Jimmy. No, no, nothing can take, no, nothing can take him down. He's the boy champion. Yeah. No, no, nothing can take. You can't take him down. He's got juice in the tank. Up a halfback flank. I got news for you, baby. Looking at the boy. 
best player in the whole world ever. There wouldn't be many AFL players right now who have a song. I'd agree. Dedicated to. I'd agree them. with that. Alex Ishenko, he's got a song about him. Who does he play for? Uh, he used to play for North Melbourne and West Coast. <laughs> yeah, Coast. that's what I thought. Ishenko. Okay, oh, so Ishenko. we got, we've got oh, the boy, like a Russian Hewitt, tank. and Harley Reid. Who's the fourth of the future of West Coast on the mountain? Allen. Allen. Allen? Allen. That's a good. Awesome Noah Allen. Long. Noah Long's a yeah, man. Yeah, he's that also the fucking. Them. Boy, I First love time that I met Noah Long, hippie club. He had white globes, white belt, jean shorts, and a double polo on. Tell me that doesn't <laughs> tell you. <laughs> no, tell me that's not no Noah Long. He's the best player said. ever. Enough said. said. Noah Long is going to be on the Mount Rushmore. He's, okay. the, he's my favourite player. Is hippie club open on a Monday night? Round 22. Like let's, keep going. Let's, let's just keep looking at uh, Swimply. Round 22 is happening right now in the Brownlow. It's Melbourne v. Carlton. Swimply. Thanks. Swimply the best. Anyone want a beer? <laughs> Three moments. Yes, I do. Nick's There's taking one. his blazer off because he's hot. Dan, I'm gonna just yes, please. Yep. I will walk it over to you in a brief a moment. Bye bye, okay. James. Leave it right you there. Just got All right, we've got James. three moments for everyone. Strictly the best. The oh. first moment. Yes. Blake Acres. Blake Acres' hair spoiling. Yes. Spoiling a Brisbane goal. That was a good moment. His hair was sticking up. Just touch the hair. I saw that. Did is this the brown lower or is this that? us? No, that's the. It's a strip That's a shit question, Dan, because I have bald hair. I don't have any hair. Just okay. like, is that, oh, that's the brown lower. That's moment A. It's moment, round 22. Moment Got to be honest, Dan. Give us a second moment because we're about to moment get Moment two, Jack Buckley stopping everything. Oh Jack, Buckley. Jack Buckley. God, Jack Buckley gets three votes. Buckley. Jack Buckley gets three votes for Schwimply, not for, you know, we're obviously. Moment, moment three, Toby Green snap. Very good. Very good Left snap. foot, on the run, one touch. Don't even worry about it. Nick. No. Nick Josh. Ah, Josh and Nick. Josh and Nick, have a drink. Nick Dacos is still winning the brown low, everybody. Yeah, not for long. Ooh. There's only 22. Tw- there's only three rounds to go. Andrew Brayshaw. And... Lucky shoots. Oh. It was fucking good, that game. Lucky Marcus Bott. Wow. John Newcomb is on 18 votes. Nick Dacos could hold on. Errol no. Goulden. Errol Goulden. Errol Goulden. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Chad Warner with a three. <laughs> Fuck you, Chad. Fuck you, Chad. Shock a name, Chad. Zach Butters, 21 votes. Conor Rosie, 2019 votes. He's taking votes off each other. The Jason Hornet. Horn. Speaking he's, of he's the best midfield well. in the country. Here we go. Six Lock in here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh. There's no way Nick Dacos wins. So, Bontempelli wins his vote. Well, I way. think Petrarca does. Yeah. Or Neil. Mate, Bontempelli's too far behind. Or Neil. It's, it's got to be Neil or Petrarca. Behind. Nick can't poll. Here we go. Petrarca. Petrarca. See Petrarca. Oh, oh Batty Coots is going to win. <laughs> he's going to see his penalty. Nick Dacos might win a fucking Brownlow medal and go. he's got to deliver him. A... Hang on, hang on. There's two, how many rounds left? Two, two. rounds left. Holy Petrarca. shit. Lockie Neal, stun mullet. He's on the waters. Lockie Neal can't win anymore, I don't think. Hang on a second. What are you talking about? What's he on? 23 votes, 22 votes. Nick Dacos cannot win. Well, Nick Dacos, is, he's winning but currently. He's, he can't vote. Continue, Dan. Who wins Shrimply? I think Jack Buckley does. Look, moment, Jack Buckley, moment number two. Blake or, Akers. Yep, or Toby, Toby Green, Green snap. I think it's pretty obvious. We never, we never interject and we no, never tell Jack people Buckley what wins. to vote for. But Jack Buckley, of course, is going to win Shrimply the best. Um, if anyone doesn't know, we have a sort of new website, backchatstudios.com.au. Merch. Merch. Or oh, shit chair merch. All, all of the shows that we make. Merch. 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 Fines. Mum. If you want to submit fines, you can go there. Mamba Digital. Of course, but then Mamba, Mamba Digital. Mamba Digital make that website happen. I'll be quiet. The digital marketers. Round 23. Keep going. <laughs> you know Mamba Digital more than anyone. They're digital story. marketers. They do sales. They do websites. You want to make more sales? You go to digital marketing and you go to Mamba Digital. Oh, Dylan. Oh, fucking Deb, Deb Robertson. Robertson. Future West Coast Eagle, Devin Robinson. I'm telling this you right boat, now, Dan. He the put on like, taken over right What did now. he put on? He put on like 80,000 followers. Crippa gets three votes. Boo. There's no way Crippa doesn't get three votes here. 
Wow. That is a goal. You've butchered that. Lockie oh, Keys, devastating. The difference oh, between Adelaide Isaac, that, getting into the finals. Isaac Rankin punching the ground. Tex wouldn't have been mad. Oh, wow. Charlie, Charlie Kerno. Would have what been nice to see him Charlie in finals. Oh, yeah. speaking of in finals, Jesse Hogan, wasn't he good? Did, did Charlie play in the finals? No, I, I think he, him oh, and Harry sorry. got um, concussed. Two rounds to go. Matthias. There's, there's only a certain amount of people that can win the Brown. I think there's about four that can win. Oh, Trent. Oh, Trent. See you, Jack. Bye-bye. See you, Jack. Jack and Trent. See you later. Bye, Jack. Jack's evil. Good player, good player, good player. No, oh. I don't think he was, actually. To be honest. Oh, I loved him, mate. I was an old fan growing I up. I do not like Jack's evil. Fair All right, here we go. Round 23. There's Nick Dacos nah. is leading by two. The top six can win it. Cripps, Anderson, Gordon, Bontevalli, Neil, Petrarca. Noah Petr- Anderson cannot fucking win the Brownlow. Petrarca could win the Brownlow in this round, can. right? With three votes. Nick Petrarca Dacos does not get any more votes for anyone listening. Andrew Brayshaw, get a no, camera not this, on him. No, nah, he gets three votes in round four. I guarantee Jack you. Buckley. Jay Buckley. Jack Buckley. Jack Buckley. Jack Buckley. Jack Buckley. Jack Buckley. Buckley. Oh. Ah. Jesse Buck. We love Jesse Hogan. Oh, piss off, Jesse. Uh, Patty Cripps. Patty Cripps needs three votes to be any chance. No. no. Bye Patrick bye. Cripps is out Ed of the round. Ed had enough. He's going to bed Ed soon. Ed <laughs> is pissed. He's not wearing Caleb a tie. Caleb Sarong, one vote. Andy. Connor Rosie, one Andy. vote. Nick Dacos. Zach <laughs> Butters <laughs> cannot win. Zach cannot Butters win. cannot win. Cannot win. Nick Dacos might hold. Petrarca needs votes here. Petrarca needs votes here. Oh my God! Oh! Jack Viney! Jack Viney! Is it going to be a draw? Nick Dacos is going to fucking right win. Now. It's going to be a draw. I'm gonna check. It's not going to be a draw. Nick Dacos cannot win. Errol? Errol! 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 Yes! Yeah! Errol Gordon is in the run again. His name's Errol. Errol Gordon has two goals and 42 touches in the last game of the year. Oh, oh my boy. God. His Errol. name is Errol. Errol gets three in the next round. But I think Christian Petrarca might get West one. West Coast win this game. It's going to be a tie between Errol Gordon and Christian Petrarca. Have a drink. Errol Gordon's going to win the fucking Bons round. Bonte Crips. Oh, my God. Oh, Crips three. Bonte Pally's two behind. Crips three. What does Bont have in the last Have round? a drink. <laughs> have a drink. <laughs> nah. Nick Dacos could be a chance here. Whispers. Oh, whispers. Errol Gordon's going to win the fucking Brownlow. Errol. Errol. Has anyone got Errol? Who's got Errol? Who's got Errol? Errol Gordon? What's happening? Goal! What's happening? Oh, Look at it. Oh, 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 it's absolute seeds at the front of What does Lockie have in the last round of the what year? What the fuck it's is that? It's the heart and soul of WA. It's the heart and soul. Where is? Who did Brisbane play in the last fucking round? I can't find it. Hurry up. <laughs> Where's my phone? Lockie Neal has 30 and nothing in the last round. Lockie's going to get three Errol's winning the brown though. Errol is winning. What's Bond Errol, Valley? Errol Bond and Valley. Lockie. Bont's, Errol, no, no, Bond's done. Errol and Lockie will get three. Bond's done. Bond won't get three votes. Errol and Lockie are going to tie for the brown. Why is Errol not up there? For <laughs> fuck's sake. <laughs> the cut's going to win. Sorry. Where's my phone? I've said the C word. Look at him. Yes. Now we're talking. Nick. He's pissed. He didn't <laughs> think he was going to go anywhere he near He doesn't have any moose in the hair. That is loose. Look how loose his hair is. Lockie Neal's going to win the Brownlow like medal. like Dan Const. You Lockie heard of a shower? Neal. <laughs> Ever heard of a barber or a shower? Lockie Neal's going to win it. Lockie's two it. votes in front of Errol. I lost my phone. It Who doesn't cares? matter. Forget about your phone. Uh, Hammer, we can't do Blue Bet. Oh, we're doing here. a podcast. We're doing oh, a podcast, yeah. of course. Fuck. Blue Errol Bet. is winning this. Look at Cornelio. He is cooked in the background. <laughs> nah, Lockie Neal wins it. He gets three in the next round. Who's going to win this? Just... Just hang on a second. Rocky Neal gets three votes this round. Does he? Does he have yeah. 40 and two? He had 30. But Errol Gordon gets three. So if Lockie gets one, Errol's going to get three. He had 42 and two in the so last Lockie, game. So who? Errol Gordon. Well, Why does Rocky get three? Lockie had the most touches on ground and no one else did anything. Oof. Fuck me. Lockie, Lockie Neal's going to win the brown low. Lockie Neal's going to win two brown lows. AFL.com. Here we go, round 25. Oh, my God. Here we go. 
Ah, oh, who cares? Where's who cares? Where's Bont? Fast forward, skip, danger. Paddy Dangerfield, how about you sip on your red wine, you fucking. No, oh, piss off. Wall, seriously. Oh, do it on the hamstring. Well done, See mate. You you're a legend. We do like Bont. That. Bont, you're not going to win it. Sorry, mate. Nick Lucky, what a star. <laughs> did he gifted get, fucking. Did he kick West Coast? That game? Yeah, gifted West Coast the last right, pick. Wrap first it up, pick. North Melbourne. You finished fucking second last on the Tom Hickey. Shout out Tom Hickey. Petrarca. Is he the running? Nah. Goulden has 42 and 2 that game. Petrarca's pretty happy. Yeah, but Goulden had 42 and 2. 42 and 2. They do lose. Could he get the Who two cares? Players? Best game ever. Charlie oh. Kerno, you did nothing in the finals. Toby Green, best player ever. Toby Green. We Canelio. Love him. Oh, we love this. Give it the fucking Phantom, whatever the hell. Here we go, oh round 24. This is hectic. This is the decider. This is good. Nick Dacos currently equal first. Nick 28 Dacos votes. Can't lose. He knows Dacos. he's not going to win Bons it. Bons Valley is 26. Win. Gordon 26. Petrarca 26. Here we go. And they haven't put Gordon on the split screen. They it's haven't. outrageous. Which is weird. Nick Dacos. Win it. Oh, piss this off. Oh, Hurry up, Gillen. Taron Thomas. Taron Thomas, who are you? Misogynist pig. Yeah, fuck, fair enough. Where's Brayshaw. Errol Goulden? Brayshaw. Oh! Yeah. What the fuck, Andrew Brayshaw? He wouldn't have given us the finger wiggles anyway. Righto, Nick Dacos. Wrap needs it to up. find three See votes out of nowhere. Here we go. Piss off, Nick. <laughs> three votes. Why is Errol not on the fucking split screen? They know. They Bond know. Pelly, Toby please. Green. They know. Man. Oh, that's 20 votes. Decent. They don't know. Lockie no. Neal's going to fucking win the thing. They know. Hey. Boo! Taylor Walker, three votes. Taylor Walker. Boo, Taylor. Here we go. I'll piss off with this shit. Wrap it up, Port Adelaide. Dustin, whatever, Dusty. you're the best player ever. Fuck okay. Off. Oh, who cares? Jack, Jack Butters. Butters. Oh, what up, man? Hey, Zach Butters, you, came, you got 27 better. votes. Piss off. Here we go. Sydney. Errol, Errol. Errol. Fucking Golden. Come on, Errol. Come on, Errol. Sydney. Three votes. Errol Golden. Come, Come on, Errol. Errol. He's it's not, not getting, one vote. He's looking three. We need more than two. He's not three. Oh! Bullshit. Pachaka. Three votes. Errol Golden. Fuck you. Ended with 27 votes. 42 and two. Go and root your mother. Give me Petrarca. Oh, three. Bailey Fritch, fuck off. Petrarca's getting cut. three. Petrarca's getting three. Bailey Fritch, get a haircut. Getting three. But, oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sucked in, Petrarca. Lock Nick Dacos cannot win it. Is Lockie Neal's won two Brownlow medals. Is Lockie Neal going back to back? What's Bontempelli on? Fuck me. We need three, three. votes to Bontempelli. Three. Oh, three, three votes. <laughs> Three votes, Montebelli. Three votes, Montebelli. I'm telling you right now, three votes, Montebelli. Give it to me. Yeah! Yeah! He's winning the brown loop. Lucky Neal shits it in from here. Lucky Neal. Marcus Montebelli currently leading the votes with 29. This is fucked. This is absolutely fucked. Fuck. Why have they got Nick Dacos on there? He doesn't even play. Fuck off, Nick Dacos. Piss off, Nick. Brisbane Lions. One vote. If this one doesn't vote, go Lockie Neal, one vote. It's over. Kitty. Lockie Neal wins another Brownlow. Two votes. Lockie Neal. Three votes. Two oh. votes. Oh. Is oh, my God. oh, my God. L. Neal. Three, Three votes. votes. Lockie Neal. Who's gonna win? Oh, yeah! yeah. <laughs> well, there's a big, big sound from the west of the town. It's the sound of the mighty giant. With the ground is shaking, the other teams are quaking in their boots before the giants. We take the highest strides and the highest leap. We're stronger than the rest. The greater West of Sydney Giants We're the biggest and the best And we will never surrender We'll fight until the end the Why is Chris Bacon presenting the medal? Because they're in Brisbane He's in Brisbane So they obviously knew about it Well no, they have medals they, there in case Lockie Neal has just, just a spare won Brownlow Yeah, they have them everywhere Lockie Neal's just Can won we the 2023 the Brownlow medal Shh. Can we...
Let's Can we play a Fleet Network ad on in a piss? Yeah, let's play a Fleet Network ad. Fleet Network, if, if, you, if you don't know already and you would like to know, it'll save you money, uh, it'll help your budget, and you can get things. one of the cars that you want to get and drive around. I don't like cars. I just need somewhere to get from point A to point B. Fleet Network can do that for you while saving you money if you are employed by anybody. Yep. That is a qualification you need. You need to be an employee. I'm one of those. You could be an employer and it could help you, but yep. employees, you go to Fleet Network, they sort your shit out, and then you get yourself a car, you a know, brand new one. Yeah, you know, Ted yourself a lease and, and you're you, away. You literally, you just give it over to Frank and the boys. They handle it with everything, your employer. Everything. There's it's apps. Great. You put expenses through there. They pay you back your money. It's all inclusive. You pay one fee for the month. <sighs> Uh, so, I don't know. You get down there, you get yourself an Isuzu um, car that I've got. It's fucking great. The D-Max. Like, yeah, the D-Max, Isuzu D-Max. You go, all right, here's your Isuzu D-Max. They say, here's the amount of money you need to pay a month. That's all we heard from you. That's all she wrote. There's the money. Drive away, no more car. to pay. Shit, shit. Well, there's some to pay. There's obviously more to pay. It's an ongoing <laughs> lease. That's the whole point. <laughs> you know what, though? Last week, mm. I got Drive my Drive away, no more to pay until next month. <laughs> have to pay again. I got my car service. So idiot. I'm not with Fleet Network, <laughs> yeah. network right now. And I'm Just working towards getting a fleet service. Yes. Mm. When I got my car service, had to, I dropped it off to all that stuff. The guy was showing me all these forms. I was like, no, how much am I going to pay? He's like, do you want the extra $45? Yeah. The oil thing. I was yeah. like, man, I don't know anything yeah. about this. I should just be with Just Fleet bundle Network. it all in one cost exactly. and give it to me. But yeah, pay this. You got to pay this. How so, about you send some money here? Lesson learned. Idiot, lesson learned. I'm going to call Frank and the boys. Fleetnetwork.com.au to choose your next vehicle and leave the rest to their dedicated team of experts. Righto. Can I just give you a weird stat that I've just been text from me? Thank you. Round 14, Geelong v Port Adelaide. Port Adelaide, 16 14, 110, defeats Co uh, Geelong, sorry, 11 6, 72. So 110 plays 72. Dan Houston, 31 touches. Ollie Wines, 28 touches. Uh, as Jones. we continue down the list, Connor Rosie, 25. Mm. Je uh, Jeremy Finlayson kicked, ten, uh, kicked four. Mm. Todd Marshall had kicked three and had 15 touches. As I scroll down the list <laughs> and get to Jason Horn Francis, the Horn, who had 13 touches, one tackle for a combined total of 34 AFL fantasy points. Jason Horn Francis had three votes that game. Wow! That screams. Who was that fucking umpire that cheated so, and it, like tried to rig the votes? That screams that for me. Is that is that like cost butters the? That cost Butters, I don't know. I haven't seen the results. I can't remember. Zach Butters was robbed because of Jason Horn Francis getting a fucking vote. I don't out have a phone, time. so no idea. Well done, Lockie. Proud of you, buddy. Here we go. You said it. We read it. We've been doing a podcast this of whole course, time. Of course. Of course we've been doing a podcast the entire time. You well. send it. We read it. If it's good, thanks to Leadville Cameras. If it's cameras. good. Has anyone been to Leadville Cameras uh, and seen Lidio? Yeah. yeah. Hands going up. A lot everywhere. of hands going up. In the crowd. I count I one, two, three, lot. four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. I count about thirty thousand hands. Tell them Scoey sent you. You get twenty bucks off. You actually do. You, you do actually get 20 bucks do. Off. That's pretty. Tell them twenty bucks off. Yeah, thank you very much. If you thank buy you. something for a dollar, he'll give you ninety. He basically gives you ninety dollars. <laughs> so basically, yeah, for cash. anyone who is listening at home and here in the paddo, Dan has for whatever reason decided to fight Lydio. Lydio yes. is a black belt in karate. Karate, and I'm not sure what other discipline. But Dan is Just not, karate. and they have decided <laughs> to have a fight, uh, nude Greco-Roman wrestling style, <laughs> oiled up, ready to go, yep. slippery, and just go for it. Um, jelly, jelly. But in the top floor of Lydia, uh, Leadable Camera House. So if anyone gets down there and wants to come and see the fight, we'll, we'll sort that out. Of course. Uh, I'm going to read you out some emails. Let's just, like... Who cares about the brown I couldn't there? care less about Lockie Neal winning his second brown Of course. We're going to ignore that. Can we turn uh, it off? This is from Rick. It says, Will, just listen to you and Skeet and realised you were here, Geelong, for your brother's passing. I'm yes. so very sorry for your loss, mate. Yes. As you know, I've been a listener of yours and a strong supporter of the Eagles from day one. Thank you, Rick. I hope you realise I'm genuinely sorry for you and your family. I okay, lost my brother you, during COVID and none of our family could travel to Hobart for his funeral. Uh, it's heartbreaking. remains the saddest period of my time for all of us. Obviously, the last days of your brother's life are definitely private and should remain so. But I hope you had a chance to embrace him and give your love before he left. Take care. Rick. Thank you, Rick. 
Thank you, Rick. Shout out, really good, Rick. Thank you, Rick. Shout out, Rick. G'day, Legends. This is from. It's from the world's longest email. I can't believe Lockie Neal won the Brownlow. Keep going. I can't believe Rock, Lucky read it. Uh, okay, this says, Okay, legend, ever since I can He's still it. fucking speaking. Yeah. He's a dual Brownlow medalist. We, we, we will have heard it with the first speech, surely. What else is he saying? Oh, it's, just, it's a team award. Oh, I'd love, you know, oh, obviously we're, we're looking forward to going what, this what week. What did you say in your speech? I can't remember. I'm pretty, <laughs> I can't say it because we're on air. I okay. thanked West Coast a lot knowing I'd lose my job. Okay. G'day legends, ever since I can remember, pretty <laughs> commentators have loved Shout using, out West Coast. using the term the premiership quarter, yep. especially at this time of the year. Every footy fan knows what it means, and the term is so pervasive. The third quarter, the third quarter. The third quarter is the premiership quarter. That is infiltrated netball commentary as well. What? Uh, I decided to investigate whether there's any truth to it. Here's what I found. In the 124 VFL-AFL Grand Finals played to date, the winner of the first quarter has gone on to win the flag 87 times. That's a lot. That's a lot. Second quarter, 84. The winner of the third quarter, 87. Same as the first. And the fourth quarter, 84. Okay, so the third and the first quarter of the premiership quarters. 87, 84, 87, it's 84. It's nondescript. So it's fair to say that it appears basically statistically insignificant. How about if we only took the most 50 recent grand finals? Well, the numbers are 34, 35, 38.5, 40. The 25 most recent grand finals, blah, blah, blah. So the third quarter is not the premiership so quarter. St- statistically, it's insignificant. The premiership quarter is a myth. Lockie Neal's still speaking, by the way. <laughs> <laughs> he's still, he's still What's happening? Okay, so here's the question to you. Scoey and Hammer, yep. it is your duty to share this knowledge with your more senior footy heads the next time the opportunity presents itself. Well, there's no question. Cheers, lads. Any any thoughts from you guys on the premiership quarter, third quarter, especially? Being I the think big it one? is the premiership quarter because so in the I. grand final, you come out after half time. If you start well and play well, you win the game. Yep, I couldn't have, couldn't agree more. I think if you hit them with a fucking full head of steam after half time, that puts them on the back foot. Three quarter time is like a little reset, but half time's the big one. You come out after that. The stats, you come out like a German the band. The stats say what you guys just said. Don't challenge team. us. We know what we're talking about. We played <laughs> the game at the top level, Dan. Only once. Hey. Okay. <laughs> I think we probably won that third quarter, to be fair. All right, but anyway, great. Uh, this as long re- as I'm being fair. Uh, here we go. This we're very sick. close for some fan interaction for best dressed. And Lockie nearly still speaking. Here at the Pado, uh, that, that the I'm best just... dressed is taking home some shelters. Absolutely. Uh, oh. This is from Sam. Hey, guys. Let's say the Eagles are more or less going to pick Harley at pick one. Yep. Yep. Can they tell him nah. and pre-organize training for him? So if... if well, oh, sorry, yeah, yeah, yeah. Can they pre-organize training for him? So, yeah. So, what, so when do you have to uh, appear at West Coast for the first time after you get drafted? Well, the day yeah. you're drafted. The day you're drafted, you can rock up. But like, so if they know oh, they're going to... Send... I was at West Coast two days after I was drafted. Okay, they so can send him a text saying, hey, mate, just in case, here's our training program. Yes, could they do that? Would, I think yeah, so. they could. Do you want to do it? You can if you like. Okay, great. It's a great question. It is actually, it actually is a good question. It's a very good question. Can they, can they preset some training Probably. Regime? Lockie Neal is still, still speaking. Okay, one, one more email for you both. Hello, gentlemen. Hi. Hi. I would like to combine my email with a fine for one Dan Const. Fuck you, Dan. And how he always goes on about he is going to put his pool up on Swimply, but hasn't yet so far. Yes. That's bull. You have to apologise myself. I'm wrong for my next point. He hasn't even offered Hammer or Scoey to come around to his house. You haven't? Spend. Actually, that's a great point. I actually point. have not had an offer. I have not had an offer to come around and have a beer in your the pool. The offer has not existed. And they are his co-hosts. They are. Uh, if I'm not even... <laughs> If I'm, not evil, if I'm not even able to swim in his pool, hopefully Hammer and Scoey can. Therefore, I'd love to swim in your pool, mate. Come over any time. Should I ask Beck or not? She doesn't care. She's, Beck! She's not listening. She's when like, can I come over for a swim? She doesn't know what happens. Whenever? Therefore, I'd like to find Dan 50 cents. I can come over whenever. He wants to find me every week for having... Good. Me, as you, as you should deserve. Okay, so this is for you, Will. 
I say this tongue in cheek as sarcasm doesn't convey o- uh, well over email. Doesn't. But a Collingwood and Brisbane playing for the Will Schofield Cup on Saturday. Yeah, that may be. Due to your opinions on both teams throughout the year. Brisbane can't play at the G and Collingwood are shit. Okay. P.S. With the news of Dan getting the snip, this is a call out to other listeners to share their snip stories as yeah. there has been a shortage of them Let's lately. Get a few, yeah, fucking oath. Let's get some more snip stories out there. Thank you, Dan. If you have... Had a sip recently, please write in. Lockie Neal's still speaking, everybody. Just oh, he's actually still going. Lockie Neal's just written. He's fucking recited Shakespeare up there. He's just reading Hamlet verbatim. All right. Okay, Come on, I, I want some fan interaction. One last thing before we do some fan interaction. Tomorrow on the podcast, we do have Corey McKernan. Won a Brownlow. Won a Brownlow, rubbed lost out. Brownlow. Wow. Lost won it. Won a Brownlow, rubbed out. That he also hurt. won a... A uh, rising star. Norm Smith should have won it, didn't win Norm it. St- Norm Smith. So he could have done a lot of things, but he hasn't done anything. Well, Errol Goulden should have got three votes there. He could have had the most. Lockheed would have still won. He could have had the greatest I, AFL resume. Corey of all time. McKernan, listen to it next week. I want the best dressed up here. Okay. I'm sorry. All right. Nicholas. Nick. Nick. Where, where are, are our best dressed? It's time for a fashion parade, ladies and gentlemen. Um, fashion show. Fashion show. Now, Nick's taking the jacket off. I would like the best dressed up here. Julian's up here early. I tell you what, we gave you that T-shirt, mate. Lockie is still going. He's still talking. <laughs> All, right. All right. Best dressed for the night at the Paddo. Um, we're going to have a little interview, I, I believe. Yes, is it the microphone here? Yep. Dan, if maybe you need to unplug it, maybe. And we might have a little little chat, I reckon. So come up. Um, yeah, you could work, Dan. I'll, I'll do the chatting. Ladies and gentlemen, Dan, ask the name, uh, location, maybe a- ASL. ASL. Dan, turn around. ABN. All right, here we go. Ben Brown doesn't want to come up. Ben Brown. Ben down. Brown with a sparkly bow tie. Who have, on, we Who have we got here, Dan? All right. Get him up. All right, come, up, come up to the middle, mate. Well, don't trip on the mic. Where's the jacket? Okay. So, what's your name, mate? Uh, Jackson. 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 We've got Jackson up here for Best Dressed. Uh, do you want me to comment on what's happening here? Oh, absolutely. I'll also join some in. Some brown that. leather, some khaki pants, a white shirt. Very good, Jackson. Yeah, Jackson! Yeah. Bit of a spin around. Oh, there's some booze from the crowd. Okay, understood. We've got our girlfriends out for tonight, dressed up in suits. Dressed to oh, the fucking very good girls. Have right. a look at them. They have absolutely no idea who you guys are, but we said <laughs> come along for the ride and join in. Wow. Very good. Good on to Jackson. What are their names? What's that, mate? Well, let's let's ask them. Come come up here. Come on. Name. Emily. Emily. And beautiful name. Who are you wearing? I'm wearing my boyfriend's blazer. (laughs) Nice. (laughs) And I'm wearing my boyfriend's roommate's pants. Very fucking good, Emily. Yeah, they're your pants. So I don't know who. You don't know who? That's fine. And uh, we'll go to. Is this lavender? It looks lavender for mine. Lavender. Violet. And let's. Call the colour my purple party suit. That's wow. Right. Who? What? Who? Which player have you got in your pocket? Oh, this is. Oh, lucky Neil! Oh, lucky Neil! Hey, a minute. Can we just get a check if he's still speaking? No, he's done. Lucky Neil. No, he's done. He's done. Okay, so we have. We haven't. We don't have it. Wait, and we got one more person over here for best. Hang oh, on a minute. You're wait. just leaving lavender two suit. More, two more. Come What's on, lavender's mate. name? Do we even get La- a name? Sorry, lavender. What was this? Sorry. Your name. Your sorry. Name? Oh, Emily. Oh, Emily. another beautiful name. Wow, what are the chances? Yeah. Double Emily's. Uh, we've got two for uh, one special. I don't Holy know where. shit, oh that is my a fucking God. fantastic shirt. Head to the front, mate. Errol Goulden, you were Rob. Yeah, Errol Goulden in your pocket. Name, uh, yeah. please. Uh, Errol Bo- oh, my name's Nathan, not Errol. <laughs> Imagine if it was Emily. <laughs> Nathan. <laughs> Sorry, forgetting that Errol Goulden oh, was yeah. robbed. He was robbed. Where'd Errol. you get your shirt from? Uh, the shirt was uh, recommended by my mate Jaden. He said, Scoey assured me that everyone wanted to wear a wacky shirt. And I'm the odd one out. No, you're the fucking best dressed nah, here. Bit, well, not Emily, yet. You're looking very good, yeah. Emily. A couple of Emily's. A few Emily's r- wrong. What up. a wonderful name. All right. Can't hear nothing. Great. Right, right. Just head to the back there. We've got a line of people. Thanks, keep, Emily. At keep, the moment, keep at up. the moment, the two Emily's are the best dressed. Yeah, no say. question. All right. Uh, name's Bevan. I uh, haven't oh. ironed my shirt since I moved out of home six years ago. So, uh, <laughs> Respect the shit out of it, Bevan. Best dressed. 
so that's fine. <laughs> Bevan, respect the shit Bevan. out of that. Yeah. Have a look I at also that. don't think you've uh, ever been introduced to shoe polish by the looks of it. Yeah, no. Oh, yeah, I lost that. And Bevan. Yeah, respect Bevan. Bevan. Were you, you need to sweeping... tuck your shirt in, Bevan? Yeah, the belt's on for the sake of Were you sweeping chimneys up. in these? Like, what's happening with the shoes? Are you sweeping chimneys? And... Well, so the shoes are also <laughs> borrowed from a housemate. Um, this is the what, what sort of fucking mine, house are you living in? Borrowed, the belt's first, borrowed. This is a big brother house. Everyone's just sitting around living yeah. in one house together. Yeah, pretty much, yeah. Righto, so we've had four Emilys up. Hey, um, before <laughs> Bevan leaves, I just want to talk to you about your little tickler on the top lip there. Oh, yeah, look whale, at that thing. Whale bristles. bristles. Look, I didn't yeah. sniff. Whale bristles. They look like um, the boys' bristles. That's what wow. they look like. They're, they look quite orange. Could be... Could be uh, Slightly related in a way, but we're not going to... Oh, hang on. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, no, no. Hang on. You can't be it's trying strange. to run related to the boy. No, no. It's a long story, but uh, my sister's been up at the East Perth Club for a long time, so... Respect, Respect the East Perth Royals. Respect the mighty Thank East Perth Royals, mate. Thank you, Bevan. Royals, mate. Uh, round of for Evan, Thank everybody. you, Bevan. Bevan. Ben Brown. Ben Brown, ben Brown. Ben Brown. Ben Brown everybody. Ben wow. Yeah. Enough you know, said. Your name's Ben, obviously. Yeah, Ben Brown, yep. What okay. is your actual name? Uh, Rab. Rav, Rav, Rav Four, Toyota. Tell us about the tie, Rav. Uh, this is actually show. from like my high school ball from quite a you while You wore ago. that to a high school <laughs> ball. <laughs> it, it, matched, it matched my uh, girlfriend. Emily, dress at Emily the time. is yeah, touching up Ben Brown here. So, are you all living in the same house? Yeah, this is a clown <laughs> what house. What is this? Is a cult? <laughs> uh, did you get lucky on your high school ball night? Yes, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> tie says it all. <laughs> Hey, hey, I was looking like this, mate. Of course. Oh, Rav Four, shut up and take my money. Who all right, Rav. Well done. Oh, here ben. we go. Oh, we got a bang FC and oh, show us, show us the inside of your your blazer as oh well. My oh my god! Yeah. Yeah. Holy shit! shit. It's a f- oh, oh my <laughs> god! Fan favorite here. Oh, wow. What number have you got in back? Tom Cole. Ladies Tommy and gentlemen. Cole, ladies here and gentlemen. Oh, what, what was the uh, decision <laughs> around twenty eight? Uh, it's my birthday. Of what? May. Every year. Oh, shout out to 28th of May. Anyone else? Anyone else here the 28th of May? You've got no. a problem with that, Dan. <laughs> You're very inquisitive about the 28th. Uh, just, I don't know if you know. Do you know Stuart Henry? Stuart Henry? I'm yeah, not... 28th of October. That's his birthday, so. No. Oh, Stuart Henry. Fuck me. <laughs> the bottom of the barrel. Oh, I've got Talk a, to I've us got about Bang, what's Bang FC. What is Bang? Hey! Is that my I phone? Got it. I uh, tell us phone. about Bang FC. Uh, so Bang FC, it's a social football club. We play every Sunday, 8.30 a.m. at uh, Laugh Lane Park. Yeah, we do. Everybody's welcome, very <laughs> inclusive. Uh, you know, people who out of footy want to have a kick around, that kind of thing. You know, everyone's welcome down. Coming to the end of the season this year, going to have our wind-up at uh, Dutch Trading Company. Uh, everyone else come on down as well to that. Yeah, yeah, shel- the what shelter is, tap, What yeah. does the best player of the year get awarded? Uh, they get the SCOE. Oh, That's boy. Scoey. Usually presented by Scoey. Well, I've, well, I'm one from one at the moment. What do you mean usually? <laughs> I came the first year. Davey, Davey, Davey. 100% Davey. strike rate. 100% strike rate. Are you going rate. this year? Absolutely. No invite as yet. No invite as yet. Now, Dave. It's, uh, check, check your, check your uh, junk mail, maybe. <laughs> Absolutely. Hold. Uh, very good. Well, hang on a minute. I'm just... I've, a couple of things, firstly. Um, I am hearing here... What? There's a recount. Whoever's wearing the suit on the underneath, the jersey underneath the suit, wore the same suit to the Oscars. Yes. Oscars. Yes. To the Oscars? Oscars. Yes. You've been to You've the been Oscars. You've been to the Oscars. Yes. What, what the fuck were you doing How? at the Oscars? What? I asked You're myself. Now the pano, the the elaborate. The pinnacle. The pano on a yeah. Monday night. 2020, 2022 Oscars <laughs> for the... What? <laughs> Well, hang on a minute. Oh, for the Will Smith slap. Yeah, that makes a lot more sense. This is the post for the Smith hitting Dan in the face. Get uh, what yeah, what were you this at is the... What um, you say. <laughs> get your wife. I've, I've got a mic. I don't need two. Can I... That, <laughs> what what, what were you face. doing at the Oscars? Uh, I worked on a short film that just magically made it all the way to the end. What was you the an Oscar? Sorry? Did you win? We did not win. Disappointing. Ooh. What was That's the film? Uh, a short film called Please Hold. Please hold as yeah, we welcome our next guest. Yeah. <laughs> wow. 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 Dave, well done. Fantastic. 
Sensational. I know Dave's name because he uh, he is a part of our walking footy crew at uh, East Victoria Park. I can't believe we've just got West Coast, not over 55, so just let's keep that one quiet. Wow. Holy, Holy shit. Holy shit. Race day it. shit. What is this? What's this little blue tie clip? Oh, it's, just a, it's just a clip. I don't know how I follow that, up, by the way. That is fucking amazing. Did you go to the Oscars? Did you go to the Oscars? No, I did not. Okay, did you slap me in the what? face? No, I did not. Well, you're dressed, free. though. I tell you so, what, you're well dressed. Well, Who are dressed by? Yeah, well. I got married in this jacket, so... <laughs> oh, wow! That's very good. Shout Wait, out to your where, partner. I where's, do not fit into my wedding jacket. Yeah. Where's your wife? At home with the kids. That's a bold <laughs> assumption. <laughs> it's a bold <laughs> assumption, Dan. Yeah. That's right. I just want to know where. Where's your wife, Dan? She's here. Oh, hi, Dan. <laughs> hey, Beck. Uh, okay, yeah. so tell us about your suit. Where'd yeah, you, respect. Where'd you get it? Van Houston. What's that? Dan Houston. Van, Van Houston. <laughs> not, not Dan Houston. So underrated. <laughs> that could have been the most underrated thing that said this entire night. Dan Houston. <laughs> I like Van the tie Houston. clip. What, what, what spurred on the decision to get the tie clip as, a, as an option? I don't know, just to mix it up. But I did see Scoey wearing the purple, so I thought I should wear a purple. Oh, this is maroon, just so we, just so we burgundy. know. Burgundy. I think it's burgundy. Maroon, purple, same shit. Okay. Yeah, mate, Very nice. Mate, mate well Ladies and gentlemen, uh, round of applause for all the uh, best dressed. Now, um, I think we're going to award the best dressed right now. Absolutely. And I'm just ready to here to interview them. Um, wow. I'm going to go. How, how do we do this? I think, we can pick a, I think we pick a top three audience. Uh, all right. So I, I reckon. Well, well, I'm gonna well, do here's my top three. What I'm going to do. Here's my top three. What I'm okay. Do, yeah. okay you, you there go. you go. Yeah. My top three would be both Emily's. Yeah, and Dave, both but Emily's. That's okay. Both Emily's. Both Emily's. Both Up Emily's. Front, get out of the front. Come the to front, the front. Emily's. Both Emily's. And our Bang FC representative, Dave. No, wait, no, Dave. Wait, Dave. Wait, that Dave, would be Dave. my top three anyway. Right. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six blokes. I'm going to name one, two, three, four, five, six, and we have the biggest cheer and. Can we get together. them out the front as well? Yep. Emily, Emily, you guys are through to the final. Finals. Okay, you're through. Up the, up the front, boys. So it's just everyone. <laughs> to everyone else. And everyone else. Up come, the front, boys. Come to the front. boys but just keep front. in mind that only one is a member of Bang FC. Continue. Come to the front. All, All the right. way. No, no. no. Only one is All wearing a back chat shirt. Right. Only one is wearing a I flamingo need you in one shirt. One big row. Uh, yeah, you can touch it. One big only row. one has touched the sand of metal. All the way to the front, mate. Thank you. Ben Brown, number one, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, what? Yeah, yeah. Okay, well done. Sit, sit down, Ben. Number two in the right shirt. Oh, he Ruff. hasn't bought a jacket. Fair Ruff. enough. Fuck yeah. off. <laughs> now, number three, ladies and gentlemen, in the beautiful black suit. I've been feeling dry. And the speed dealers baby. and the tickler. Uh, number <laughs> number four, the, the best shirt in the house. That's got some. That's got something. Current leader. Current leader. Bang FC, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah! Woo! I probably shouldn't have yelled then. And the beautiful blue wedding suit. Oh my! Oh, it's okay. down to three. It's Bang down to FC three. FC versus wedding suit, boys. We 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 thank you for your service. Yeah, thank That's you for your service. Emily, stay thank there. Bang FC Who's versus these, wedding suit. Between these two. Well, wow, last two. Question. All right. Biggest cheers wins. Who I'm, wants to I'm go gonna first? be quiet. Bang FC first. Bang FC first. On the, count of three, on the count of three, bang FC. One, two, two three. Good. Okay. Shh. Wedding wedding suit. Wedding suit on the count of three. One, nice. two, three. I think, I think it's wedding I think suit. It's wedding suit. I it think could be it's wedding, wedding suit. suit. It could be no, wedding no, suit. Wedding suit. <laughs> wedding suit. <laughs> What's it, we, can we get a name? Wedding suit. It doesn't now matter. Now what do we do? Now we get the Emily's up. Emily's. It doesn't matter because you're what a beautiful name. You're losing to the Emily's. Let's they can the leave wedding suit. Okay. So we're going to start from Emily. One. Third's great wedding suit. So we, this is cheers only. Okay. I'd say we start with wedding suit. Okay. So what we're going to do is we're going to go wedding suit. We're going to go black one. suit. We're going to go lavender suit. We're going to go wedding suit, black suit, lavender suit. Okay. On the count on three. So for for wedding suit, one. So. Just before we get to Lockie Neal has finished yeah, speaking. Lockie Neal's finished speaking. You are not allowed to cheer for more than one person because that really makes it tough. Understood. Wedding suit on three. Ready? One, two, three. Wedding suit. Wow. Oh, boy. Wow. Emily. And that's enough. Bit of hype. 
It was about here. It was about here. It was about here. Rounding applause. That's about there. Yep. Remember when the Telstra Dome used to do the fucking yeah. noiseometer or whatever it was? Yeah. Righto. Yeah. Emily in the black suit in one, two, three. Sorry, Emily, black Sorry, suit. Sorry, Emily in the black suit. That is its wedding suit at the moment. And can Emily in the lavender suit with Lockie Neal in the pocket? Lockie Neal in the pocket. The brown Beautiful name. name. Lockie Neal Here we go. Pocket. Emily in the lavender suit. Beautiful name in I one, think... two, three. <laughs> Christ almighty. As much as I hate to do this, Emily in the black suit, thank you very much for coming up. You have finished third, Emily in the black suit. <laughs> Everyone, round of applause for Emily in the black suit. She's finished third. It's come Award down. Award the winner. No, we're not doing that. Like, how could you pick that? I'm going to go to wedding suit and lavender suit. <laughs> wedding suit, three, two, one. <laughs> lavender suit, three, two, one. I think it's wedding suit. I, I you, think wedding suit. I tell suit. you what, they're giving them both a prize. Oh, we're giving them both, both a prize. They're both giving them a prize, ladies and gentlemen. Well done. Oh, no. Oh, booing. They're Fuck. both getting a prize. Relax. You're going to get the same prize. Personally, I thought it was wedding suit. But wow, well done. Emily. Hey. Well, thanks. Emily. Emily in the lavender suit. Well done. Wedding suit. Sensational. Beautiful name, by the way. Congratulations, Continue. guys. Oh, well, they're going to cheers the cartons. Well cheers done. the cartons. Speech. He's already, uh, do you want to do a speech? You can if you want. Okay. Fucking hell. Lockie Neal's still going. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, really well back done. chat. Yeah, yes, yeah, really thank good. you. Yeah, good. And one, one more speech. Thank you, back Thanks, chat. guys. And shout out to Emily in the black suit. Oh, oh, yeah, shout out to Emily yes. in the black suit. Well done. Thanks. Wow. I, you can sit now, Dan. What's the deal with... Uh, what's, <laughs> the deal with microphones? <laughs> what's the deal with airline food? Are we almost done? Do you reckon you could tell us one joke? I could tell you one joke. All right. You don't need the microphone in your hand. So... <laughs> No, nah, just stay with it. Stay with it. I'm not, I'm not going to tell any jokes. Tell uh, a joke. The Brownlow's oval, uh, oval, over, but we do have some fines. Yes, we now, do. Now, the last thing we do at the, at the end of all of our podcasts, we give fines out. Yes. Yeah. Where's, where's Nick at? Nick? Nick's somewhere. I can't see where he is. Did, didn't push record on the podcast one time. No, he didn't that one time. Remember that? I'm about to burst out of this suit. There's, there's people waving at us like this. Hello. I Hello. can't see who that is. That's a neat. I think it's Master. Yeah, it's Master. It's Master. Hello, Chris Maston, Premiership player. Sorry. That doesn't look like Chris Maston. It's, it's not. not. It's not. He's, he's just really aged. Just move on. Uh, oh, Peter Pan. Oh, just... What are we watching? Bit... <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. I want to see what this, this shit. Righto, everybody, while we're watching this, Universal's just popped up. First person to shout out what movie this is wins. wins. Quick. Transformers. Pr- Batman. Pretty Transformers. Hard. X-Men. I don't know. Dark Universe. Is this Batman? Black, Black Adam. Adam. Who's that? What's the fuck Predator. Is that? What's happening? Perfect World Pictures. Never seen it before. Who? What is it? The, the Mummy. mummy. What, with Nicholas Cage? Death is but the doorway to new life. It's is the it the mummy? mummy? I think it's the mummy! It's the fucking it's the mummy! mummy. mummy. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Bum, ba, 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 ba. Hang on. Or we just give Hang on. the early cry. Hang on a second. What are we doing in, in, in England? Is this Braveheart? It's a black screen. We've given it out for the mummy, and we're England 1127. It could be the Matrix. <laughs> it's pretty tough to take it back. What is, what it? is happening? Is this the mummy? England. Why are we this in England? This is the mummy. Get it back out there. It's amazing! It's amazing! It's amazing! 
Uh, it's a big, big sound from the west of the town. It's the sound of the mighty giant. Beyond <laughs> <laughs> the teams are breaking in the moves, they fall the giant. We take the wow. highest strides and I'll see you what civilian I am. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> wow, wait. Anyway, it was the mummy. Well done. Is it 11 o'clock? Fuck, fucking hell. It it's can't be. O'clock. Okay. Hammer, there's one thing we need to do that you can't be here for. Unless you are happy to be here for. Blue bet. Just shut up. Just leave. Uh, Just shut up. Just shut your mouth. Give me six weeks. (laughs) Uh, The blue bet multi of (laughs) the week. Let's wrap this up. I want to have a beer with everyone. Let's wrap it up real quick. The blue bet multi of the week. Jack Buckley gets five spoils. Sam Taylor gets five spoils. Tom, Toby Green kicks two goals. Yes. Did anyone bet on blue bet in the crowd? We lost because... GWS lost. One point. Fuck you, Bluebet. No, we love Bluebet. We do love Bluebet, of course. Wrap it uh, up. Let's wrap this up. If you guys... Have uh, we got fines or not? No, let's... let's <coughs> well, just, fines are pretty funny. I like fines. They are funny. I'd rather, I'd rather just have a beer with everyone. That's fair. Let's, Is there any fines? Is there? Does anyone have a fine that they want to give to someone live? Okay, okay. Well, there shit. we go. Oh, Holy she's got, shit. She's got a printout. She's came prepared. Uh, somebody get this come lady. Come, up, come up to the mic. Dan, get her the microphone. It looks an awful lot like back chat bingo, but... Okay. Why were you not up here for best dressed? Wow. Okay, Scully. You, you're married. <laughs> On the... <laughs> Wait, why are you... What's this, your notes? On the Brownlow bingo, it yep. says Gil stuffs up a name. Yes. yes. How are we supposed to know he stuffs up a name if we don't have sound? Yeah, yeah it's a very fucking good point. Yes. We did say that at the Look start, didn't the we? The loves it. Yeah. yeah well, $500. $500 fine? Let's just, hang on a minute. For every, you feel like? For everyone in the crowd, let's assume that Gil stuffed up. Two, three, four, Let's five. have half a Yeah, let's spoil. have half a, half a spoil. Yeah, let's have half a spoil for Gil. It appears she's staying online for one more fine. Oh, no. Are you done? Have or? you got another fine? Oh, hello. Oh, <laughs> well done. Great fine. Okay. That's, That's how you deliver got, a fine, got, ladies and gentlemen. We've got another fine. Come up here, mate. Look out. There's... <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Wait, wait. Shit. Macedonian, Macedonian marbles. Macedonian marbles. Obviously, the... Um, Oh my it? fucking god! Yeah. Oh, I've never heard of you, Scoey, until Nathan Buckley called out your intention. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> ah! Yes, yeah. uh, just us joining the team. Sorry, continue. Continue. Yeah, no, big, big sound over there. But, uh, <laughs> no, I just want to quickly shout out uh, A1 dry cleaning. Yes, uh, so, my favorite so. dry cleaner. That's exactly my favorite dry cleaner too. Um, it's just off the back of the last fine. It said uh, about stuffing up names. Yes. If we all look at our Brownlow bingo again. As an avid Dacos fan. We've written uh, Nick and Josh Diacos. Wow! Wow! <laughs> so, wow! 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 The, the fine would have to be uh, 50 cents each. Yes, yeah, 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 on the bar for everyone. Really, oh, mate? Good. Maybe not that next one. But Jack Buckley didn't get a vote. Uh, yeah, no, that's a fair enough fine. Scoey and Dan and me, 50 cents. Although I had nothing to do with the printout. Of course. Uh, I will take full. We, do we uh, have any more fines? This is your last chance. We got a hand up. Don't come, you, come, just come, come up the front. Got to come, come to the front. Here we go. Thought Don't there might be a bit of Dutch courage at the end of Gil, this podcast. Gil, if you got a fine, what are you getting up for? Help me get, big fella. Say no Look more. Out. He's got so tattoos on his service. forearm. He means business. A couple of tattoos Very on his forearm. Very nice screen. Uh, <laughs> this is so good. So mine's not a fine. Mine's actually a credit. Okay. okay. Well, we Dan Cons right here. Yes. Yeah, okay. I uh, was going for a piss, and Dan Cons had happened to also be there with Hammer. And he had yes. a massive. And Dan had something to show Hammer. Yes. And I also happened to be there. Yes. Massive. And uh, got to see his massive rod. <laughs> Yeah! yeah! Shout out Dan Cons! But the, the fact that he's just had a vasectomy and yeah. he's still doing this show, you should be pleased. Yes! <laughs> hey, shout out Dan Cons! Yeah. Shout out Dan Cons! My boy right here. Get it out of the stage! No, don't. Oi, <laughs> were you <laughs> dressed by the same people? No, 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 no. Wow, they actually are very similar. Ooh, ooh, yeah. Ooh. Hey, respect. Great fun. Yeah. Thanks, mate. And respect. don't show it on stage, Dan, but it's nice. I've seen it. Thanks, mate. Thank Anyone you. else? We've got any more fines? Oh, here we go. Okay. The masses are coming. There's a few. I've actually got two. Uh, d- one is definitely for Will. 
Is that right, Tickler? I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you, you stand in the middle. Ladies and gentlemen down. and Dan, for I everyone. Did, I did sit down. Uh, one's for Will for calling about six players his man this year. One's for Libba, uh, Bont and yes. Toby Green. Yes, yes. So that's three to name. What about, what, hang on a minute, Tickler. What about the other three? We're allowed to rebut here. Uh, they're somewhere there. Yeah, correct. Six. I'm with the Tickler here. The you other one six. goes to uh, Hamish for uh, hugging my sister a little too long after they bowed out of the finals this year. <laughs> in the <laughs> <Perth> <laughs> finals. We love it. We know we absolutely <laughs> love it. Who's your sister? <laughs> Say no more. Say no more. <laughs> I didn't right. hear him. I didn't hear her name. All right, we got we one. Love it. We got one more fine. Last one, and then I'll have a very special announcement for everyone who's still here. All right, hello everyone. My name's uh, Barry. Hi, Barry. <laughs> Welcome, Barry. Barry McCockiner. Yeah! <laughs> yes! Oh I just want to say uh, good day to the fellas and Dan. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Someone uh, Believe it or not, my fight is for Dan tonight. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, for absolutely punching. While you're wearing a swamp green shirt. Yeah! Stop it, mate. You can't be doing that. Can't stand be doing up, that. Dan. Stand, stand up. up, Dan. Give us a look. No, stand up. Stand up. I'm you are up. punching. You. Hey, that's a fucking fine. Thank you. Thank you. Wow. All right, thanks. Thanks, mate. Get off. Go on. Go on. Yeah, no, go on. Go on. All right. Thank you. Are we almost done? Let's I, I have an announcement. All right. You want the double mic? You don't need the no, double no, no, mic. No, I've got a mic. Okay. Okay. No worries. Everyone that has hung around, we do appreciate the support. The, the we love uh, the support. The community, um, Brownlow, it was all good fun. I would like to open the bar up. I think we're shouting the bar. Ah, he's the fucking bar. It's a big, big sound from the west of the town. It's the sound of the mighty giant. With the crowds are shaking, the other teams are shaking in their boots before the giant. The fucking giant is fighting, the giant is trying to push on the giant's lips. We're stronger than the rest. We're the greater Western Sydney Giants. We're the biggest than the best. And we will never surrender, but fight until the end. We're bigger than the rest. Just act responsibly, yeah, I say. Yeah, have as many spoils as you can, but please act responsibly. One. Woo! Honestly, wow. one drink each. Everyone for coming down. We're shouting the bar. One drink each. Everyone is here. Thank you, Back Chat community. Woo! Now, every, everyone, grab your drink, sit back, and watch the mummy. <laughs> <laughs> Tom Cruise, everyone! How the fuck is he it's in there? It's the mummy. All right, we're done? All right, we're done. We're done. We're, we're doing Patreon. What are our sponsors? Thank you, our oh, sponsors. Oh, yeah, I'll thank them. Thank you. Whippersnapper Whiskey, Margarita Roasting Co., Leadable Cameras, Blue Vet, Shelter, Shelter Brewing Co., Fleet Network, Mama Digital. Nova, and Mama Digital, uh, and Fleet Network for Nova Setting. <laughs> the least. Of course. Have I forgotten anyone? Go get yourself a beer. 333 three, three, three 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 is the tab. 333 three, three is the tab. Tell them Scoey sent you. Your beauty! <laughs>